Yeah. Hey guys, Jesse Morrell here. This is uh, literally uh, the North Pole in the Arctic here in Alaska. North Pole, Alaska. And this is what they call uh, what Santa's Santa house. Claus house. Santa Claus house. Uh, we have in the yonder there is uh, Santa Claus's house in the North Pole. Over here is just the um, the reindeer. So I wanted to talk about you know should we uh, teach our children about Santa Claus? Uh, I thought take advantage of this opportunity being here in the North Pole. So you can see the reindeer. This is I guess where they train them. They got some obstacles or something. Take care of them. I can show you one over here, good one. I got uh, a friend of mine, David Grisham, he came here during Christmas season and did a rebuke uh, against Santa Claus. You know, he, parents lying to their kids about Santa Claus. Uh, all right, so there's the reindeer. Uh, are those actual reindeer? Cause, Absolutely. Because yeah. there's, usually, usually when they do Santa Claus, they don't have real reindeer, they have uh, some other type of deer. So there's caribou, which is caribou, wild, caribou. Yeah. And you're not allowed to supposedly tame those. Right. But these are rain, uh, reindeer, which have been domesticated. And these are real, real, authentic reindeer. Deal reindeer. Yep. So there you have it. North Pole Santa Claus reindeer. Um, I, I don't think you should teach your children about Santa Claus. We can start walking over there. Um, I don't think you should teach your children that Santa is real. Because number one, it's not true; it's a lie. Uh, number two, it's a it's a distraction from the real reason of the season, you know. Um, and I think a lot of atheists are actually bitter uh, kids who grew up. They found out Santa Claus was fake, and they feel like their parents lied to them. Uh, my brother. Um, claims to be an atheist, but I remember when he found out Santa wasn't real and that really hurt him. And I do think there's a connection there, that they're like, wow, my parents told me Santa was real and I've never seen him and I found out that he's fake. And my parents at the same time, Christmas time, told me Jesus was real and I've never seen him, so maybe he's fake too. So I think, I think there is a connection there, which I, I think you want to avoid when you're raising your kids. My kids, they know about Santa as a story. Just like, uh, you know, they might watch different cartoons. You know, we, we, of course we try and make them watch good things. Like they know um, Veggie Tales. They know about Veggie Tales, but they know it as a story. My kids know about Santa Claus, but they know him as a story. They think it's weird that people think Santa Claus is real. Here he is in the background. That's a, that's, you probably can't tell from the video, but that's really, really tall. I mean, that's big. And so my kids know about Santa just as a story. They know he's not a real person. They think it's weird and funny that people think he's real. And sometimes sometimes adults um, will talk to them about Santa. See how big that is? Like, if you're just tuning in now, it looks like we've got more viewers now. This is literally the North Pole uh, in the Arctic here in Atlanta, uh, Santa Claus uh, House in uh, the North Pole, Alaska. Uh, just showing you guys uh, around. We're gonna go in that building. Just since I'm here, we're doing street preaching out in the streets, uh, downtown Fairbanks. I wanted to just take advantage of this opportunity to talk to you at Santa. I know it's not Christmas time even, uh, but Santa Claus Land is here all the time. So there's his sleigh. So during Christmas time, of course, my wife. On Amazon uh, ordering you know Amazon Prime two days shipping uh, all these packages are coming to the house so the mail lady is delivering all these packages around Christmas time and says to my kids at the door oh are you excited about Santa Claus coming and uh, my I think my my son was like four years old and was just like Santa Claus is not real <laughs> you know like you think Santa Claus is real and so my four-year-old was telling that to the mail lady. She got convicted. She came back the next day and apologized because she said that uh, she, she teaches her children about Jesus and not Santa. And her children know that Santa's not real also. So she was convicted that she was pretending to my kids that Santa was real. Now, uh, of course, there was a real St. Nicholas. And uh, he's, 
you know, uh, he's got an interesting story. I like his story. I've watched some of his, um, uh, like, documentaries about St. Nick and things that he did. That was cool. Um, here's more of the classic Santa. So I'm going to show you inside. This is just a store, Santa's house. He, he's not giving away free stuff today. It's all for sale. <laughs> yeah. It's all for sale today. But um, it's fine if you want to teach your kids about the historical Santa, uh, which was a person who died. Um, it's fine if you want to teach your kids that Santa's just a story, like Rudolph is a story, like Veggie Tales is a story. But I don't think you should lie to them and tell them that it's real, because you can create a disillusion in your kids when they find out that you've been lying to them. And then they won't trust what you say about God and Jesus either. So, so my three things is that if you teach them about Santa being real, number one, it's a lie. Number two, it's a distraction from Jesus. And uh, number three, uh, it could disillusion them. Um, and they don't trust you when they find out that you were lying to them. So my kids, the fourth point, Santa's just a story, a fun story. You know, they might watch a Santa movie, which is just fun, but they don't think he's a real person. And it's fun that way. They don't feel like they're missing out on the Christmas experience because they don't believe Santa's real. But anyways, it's pretty big in here. David Grisham will go during Santa Claus season and this is where they set up the rebu Santa rebuke the Santa and tell the kids he's not real. I I don't do that. I, I tell my kids, you know, don't don't you don't have to go around and tell all the kids Santa's not real, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> you know, David does. So, anyways, God bless you guys. Just want to make a quick video here in Santa Land, the North Pole. God bless you.